So you list all the misunderstanding with Einstein and Tesla exploration. Yes. It, it's called uh, Symptoms of Einstein-Induced Insanity. Uh, example, uh, not having a clue why objects fall to the ground. Uh, thinking all action at a distance is spooky. Uh, thinking the speed of light is a speed limit. These are indications of Einstein-induced insanity and create the schizophrenia, which do not understand a unified field. For example, you must understand that charge rotation is the only origin and definition of both mass and time. Because uh, charge rotation, of course, stores inertia named mass and has a period named time. So once you know that charge rotation is the only origin and definition of both mass and time, then you avoid the stupidities of scientists saying, saying, saying that gravity bends space time. No, gravity bends the fabric upon which charge rotates and pulls charge towards center. But of course, if you do not know why an object falls to the ground, ultimately you cannot understand consciousness, you cannot understand how anything's negentropic. In fact, you can't even understand how a plasma cloud became self-aware. So you can't understand the origin of spirituality. And that all starts with not having a clue why an object falls to the ground. Mr. Einstein, Mr. Hawkins, and NASA, you're screwed until you do. <laughs> I love that you can say this alive. Like, you are, I mean, we're not reading it, you are, we're hearing you saying, Guys, you're completely upside down. Don't make any decision. You have no authority because you don't know no, how gravity is created. Right. I, I, I suggest that you defund the physics department of every university until they know why an object falls to the ground. <laughs> so they can understand consciousness and they Absolutely. can Absolutely. They don't know why anything is negentropic or centripetal. Therefore, they believe the stupidity that the universe is condemned to entropy. And in fact, it's the opposite. But you cannot know the origin of biologic negentropy, the title of my book, until you know why an object falls to the ground. Now, let me say why an object falls to the ground. If you look at the top-down view of hydrogen, which I proved by equation, 10 spirals of the golden mean shows the radii, the waves add and multiply by golden ratio their phase velocity, called recursive constructive heterodyning phase velocities. And that means a portion of the charge compression adds and multiplies the phase velocities. And that produces acceleration of charge only through golden ratio towards center, for example, in hydrogen. And that is named the gravity. And that is why objects fall to the ground. And once we know that, we can know why anything is centripetal, clouds that become angels, the origin of mind, and the origin of negentropy. entropy. 